Welcome to the session. Today we're going to talk about uh, the NIST security framework. Uh, so NIST is a, a voluntary framework developed by the National Institute of Standards and Technology, NIST, designed to help organize, manage cybersecurity risk and improve their security posture. Uh, adopted by a wide range of industries, including government, healthcare, finance, and critical infrastructure. So let's uh, first um, talk about the, the, this uh, framework. What we are discussing here is uh, um, uh, framework version 2.0. So they have uh, the updated version of the uh, original framework uh, uh, version 1.1, which is ISO 9, um, which is ISO 27001. And then we also have the implementation version we have the version 2.0, which is uh, more of a uh, voluntary framework consists of the standard guidelines and best practices to manage the uh, cybersecurity risk, actually. So let's go through the component details. So we have the five components of um, the security framework, version 1.1. Uh, it's identify, protect, detect, uh, respond, and recover. Let's go through each one detail. Uh, the first one is identify, develop and understand of your organization critical assets, systems, and risk, and then protect, uh, implement, and safeguard to protect your uh, system and data uh, from attacks. And develop, uh, detect means develop the ability to quickly identify the cybersecurity uh, events and uh, breaches. And uh, response means you know how we will uh, how attack can be. Uh, responded with the uh, solution and uh, communication and the restore uh, recover mean restore systems and operation after a cyber attack uh, uh, or cyber security event so let's go through the four implementation tire of the, the next framework uh, so the, the implementation is based on you know what is uh, relevant to your organization so the first one is adaptable uh, the characteristic of those um, implementation is that it's proactive, evolving risk management. Uh, and uh, the second one is a partial. Partial is mean defined process, consistent implementation. The characteristic of uh, partial uh, and the risk informed, um, awareness of the risk, basic cyber hygiene, and uh, repeatable means informal and reactive approach. These are the four uh, major impl uh, implementation tires. Uh, so you can adopt to your based on your organizational structure and what is uh, 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 what is uh, uh, best for your uh, uh, organization. So let's walk through the benefits of the framework. So the first benefit is improved risk management, identify and prioritize cyber uh, security risk effectively. So enhance communication, facilitate shared understanding and communication of the cyber security issues across the organization and demonstrated uh, compliance. So it, the framework help to meet the regulatory requirement and industry standard that will give more better band value for the company and, uh, and strengthen resilience, build a more resilient cyber security posture to withstand attack. So the overall, the framework helps you to improve the security posture as well as uh, um, security um, it's quickly to react to any uh, security incidents with the proper uh, procedure and pro policy. Let's go through the how you're getting started with the NIST um, uh, cybersecurity framework. So the first process is that access your current cybersecurity practice. So the first step is to make sure where we are today with our cybersecurity practice and then identify the gaps and areas improvement so identify all the requirement based on the based on what uh, where we are and uh, identify the gap and as a requirement and then for the next step is to make sure to prioritize our requirement based on the risks uh, so and um, the, uh, the implementation phase where we have uh, a better way to go is actually phase approach where we can any, any adjustment can be done during the um, execution uh, um, and uh, the last step is actually you know continuously monitor and improve your cybersecurity program. So this is uh, one of the key element where any adjustment based on what is fine the monitoring any adjustment need to be done to make sure uh, 
uh, the implementation is effective and continuously improving to ensure uh, a continuously uh, evolving uh, cyber uh, threat. Oh, here I have a few additional resources where you can look at uh, uh, the NIST cybersecurity framework website itself and also the NIST uh, cybersecurity framework frequently asked question. And there is a document which uh, pointed here for PDF document for the framework implementation guide. I hope this helps you understand uh, uh, the NIST framework and uh, its elements and the implementation and how do you get started. Uh, thanks for attending the session.